March marks Fraud Prevention Month across Canada, a month focused on encouraging people to recognize, reject, and report fraud. The Canadian Anti-Fraud Centre and the RCMP are once again joining forces to lead the 19th edition of Fraud Prevention Month. In 2022, the centre received fraud and cybercrime reports, totaling a staggering $530 million in victim losses, nearly a 40% increase from the $380 million in losses in 2021. The amount of fraud that actually gets reported at the Canadian Anti-Fraud Centre is a lot less than what actually happens. The centre estimates that only 5 to 10 percent of people report fraud. There was a group that was going through for a while doing uh, grandparent scams. A lot of the fraud that happens is through the telephone or through the internet. Um, people will impersonate the police, say that we're going to come and arrest them. Uh, if they don't pay money, the police will never ask for money. Anytime there's urgency in anything, that, that's something where maybe take a step back, ask somebody else about it. Um, in this country, the CRA is not going to come knocking on your door asking for Bitcoin or anything like that. The RCMP say if it sounds like it's too good to be true, it probably is. If you or someone you know is a victim of fraud, you're encouraged to contact the Kelowna RCMP and the Canadian Anti-Fraud Centre. For Castanet News, I'm Madison Earhart in Kelowna.